reason why sometimes people separate and a relationship ends in divorce is, well, I would say there's many reasons, but <clears throat> one of the reasons would be that uh, I would say it's lack of responsibility, uh, lack of maturity, uh, lack of uh, uh, looking long term. Um, it's very easy in this day and age to suddenly quit on, on a project. And a marriage is a very serious project, perhaps one of the most important ones in one's life. So uh, it's really a matter of uh, seeing the long-term result, that if we stick it out together uh, as a couple, there's so many benefits that come from that. Whenever there is a, a breakage or let's say a separation, it impacts a lot of people around you. Your family, your neighbors, people in your community and so on like that. Children of course get, get hurt. I believe it's a, a, there's a lot of selfishness behind you know splitting. And uh, we have to again get into that mode of sacrifice. So before you make a decision, you know, understand what you're getting involved in. A commitment is a commitment. And I would just like to say that uh, many religious or spiritual traditions have been very successful at <clears throat> putting forth that, uh, that message that it's important to stay together. <clears throat> when I was young growing up and I was raised a Christian and in one of the rooms in our home, we had a plaque there. It says, a family that prays together stays together. So a family that chants together, uh, dances together. <laughs>